Welcome, welcome to Old Orchard Beach, everybody. Right down in the heart of the action, Main Street. Got Bill's Pizza, you got Lisa's Pizza over there, Rocco's Pizza here, Palace Playland. They're just opening up early morning here. I'm gonna walk around, we're gonna look, see if there's any difference from, I was here a year ago, if any of the stores have changed. I'm just gonna walk up and down, up on the right hand side, back down on the left hand side. Just show you guys if there's any, any differences here from a year ago. Got the pier, the pier is right over there. So this is gonna be West Grand, East Grand Avenue. Right off the bat, Dairy Queen, right on the corner. I always have the students running that every year. Bill's Pizza. Get a thumbnail. So we'll walk around, look see if there's anything new for you guys. Some of you have been here before, some have never been. This will be the first time they'll see a video of Old Orchard Beach in the state of Maine. The original French fry. They're getting the fries going. We're early in the morning. People are already buying the fries. People are heading to the beach. All these people just heading to the beach. Families. Very family oriented here. Got a little restaurant in the back over there. Gonna have breakfast. You guys got the train tracks here. You guys have been here before, know the train goes back and forth. You can hear the train a bunch of times during the day. Used to be back in the day where that Bubba place is. That used to be, I think that was a subway back in the day. So you got Johnny's Shucks here, his little main lobster. You got a lobster place right here. This has been here for a few years. Like I said, see people heading to the beach as usual. You got Sensation. They used to be back in the day, used to be called Dynamite. Store, that's all your apparel, your t-shirts and your bathing suits and your chairs and all the kind of stuff, all the, the junk you could want. You got Lisa's across the street. We'll get that on the way back down. We'll walk all the way up. We'll go up to the top. As you guys know, when we get up to the top, what's going to be up there for... You got the old candy store. So you got this big parking lot right here for people that want to park. Pay and park. And go to the beach. Look at that. A lot of people. We are Labor Day weekend. And we're in Old Orchard. It's not the warmest out. I think it's going to be maybe 75 today, a high of 75. So you got your regular stores, all your beach stuff, your beach, your boards, clothing, umbrellas. You got the big parking enforcement car. All right, restaurant not open yet. People are heading down. All right, got the candy shop. I think the candy shop has gotten bigger. It looks like they have a back part of it now. Yeah, you can see that you can go in the back now. There's stuff in the back there. These candy shops seem to be the big thing. Uh, wherever it's very touristy, they're always going to have the big dogs. I mean the big dogs. Sorry about that because you got these two St. Bernards right here. You'll always have the candy stores where they sell it by the pound or by the kilo. Alright, we got here the usual. Oh, 
Saint Tropez. One of the things you notice here, people will be pulling their wagons with all their beach wear in it. And you have to go in the store. Another. Ah, right, you got all the t-shirts. Got the Huck Tua t-shirts that are already out. Don't take long and stuff comes out. All right, let's go heading up to Old Orchard Street. Got the Scottish pub in the back over here in the background. A little restaurant here, people are still just hanging out. Yeah, in the back, you've always had that Scottish pub that's been there as long as I can remember. I've been coming here for 40 years, almost 40 years. So like I said, a lot, very family oriented. Beachology, nice little store, gift store. People like to walk around in there, look, see what they have. Knickknacks, all kinds of stuff to get to decorate the house. Available space. Seems like this has been available for quite a few years. I don't know if the rent is so expensive because don't forget it's going to be seasonal here. People that come here, everything is between June and September, maybe the end of September. And then after that, this place shuts down. All right, Dixon's. Dixon's Candy Factory. Look at these chairs they put out here. So you can have people in here getting all kinds of candy and stuff. I'll just take a quick look in here. beautiful place I like these chairs all these benches that they put it looks really good nice stuff so we're up at the end of the street here at Old Orchard Street you got the bank up on the end church across the street we'll just cut across here then we'll walk down the other side see what's going on used to be a bar straight across over there I don't know if it's still there anymore sorry about the wind you guys all right, let's get across the street here. All right, just getting across the street here. So I'll show you guys, we're up at the top here of Old Orchard Street. You got the bank right across the street. You can see the sign here. It's gonna be Sacco Avenue up here at the top. I'll show you guys down here. So this is the main street heading down towards the pier. The pier is down at the end. Atlantic Ocean in the background there little Overcast Sun should come out though. We're still early in the morning Holiday weekend Labor Day September tomorrow If you guys enjoy this so we got some Churches we just walked all the way up this side here. All the way up along here. So we'll walk down. We'll see if there's anything different from my video from last year. If you guys want, you can go back and look. The video will be there. Look at this old school Bronco. This is going to be like a, around a 1970, something like that. All right, the Red Door Market in Delhi. I don't know if I ever noticed that before. Got a little jewelry store. Got Maine's Country Woods. I guess this all be stuff made out of wood that's in here for sale. All wooden signs, stuff like that. Let me just get a quick look here just at the entrance. Oh, got a coronet. Looks like a 440 coronet. Just went by old school, old school cars classic car 
All right, got a little restaurant right here. Coming up next on the right here is going to be where you can rent all those scooters and golf carts and all kinds of things that you can end up getting hurt on and somebody running into you. See, it says rent me. Even the bikes where you can pedal. I think they just have a lot of like electric stuff, but it seems to be all gas. You got a bunch over there. You can also park here. Did you guys see that beautiful, beautiful woman just walk by? That was the wife. She's just walking around looking in the stores, enjoying herself. That's pretty cool. All right, so what we got here, we got ourselves a tattoo parlor. Main ink. So that gives you guys a hint where we are. All right, Jungle Adventure. This was here last year. Arcade and all kinds of stuff going on here. Mini golf. So we're just straight across the street from St. Tropez. We saw when we walked up the other side. So if you guys uh, want to look, I'll make a couple of videos, other videos while we're here, just of other stuff. I'll walk around, just show you guys. For some of you guys have been here before, give you guys an idea you guys will see some of the stuff you've seen before you guys will enjoy it bring back some good old memories you want your t-shirts and knickknacks i always wondered here if it wasn't the same person that just owned all the t-shirt stores you know it could be because you got all these paradise beachwear atlantic beachwear saint tropez you got all these stores and it's all the same stuff in them probably just the same same bunch of people that own all these stores they just name them all different names and people buy the uh, every store because seasonal seasonal stuff it's not the easiest stuff here all right zanzibar the dune more clothing we're gonna be coming up a couple of restaurants here hope you guys are enjoying this a walk up and down Old Orchard Street, the main drag that brings you down from the top all the way down to the ocean. You start up by the bank, and you walk down towards the pier to the Atlantic Ocean. All right, here's a Lisa's Pizza. Very well known. This place has been around forever. Want to try this one here? This one here. Like we said, you got a lot of parking over here. You can see in the background some of the the games. They got the stuff for the kids here. But we'll walk down to the corner. When we get down to the corner. We'll call it a video. We got a bookstore. This bookstore has been here forever. I don't know how they can make any money having a bookstore. It's only seasonal. Dewey's. You got Rocco's Pizza right here on the corner. Bill's across the street. We got the condos up there on the corner. That's where we stay when we come here. So that way you're right in the heart of the action. So we're still in the morning here. We haven't hit lunchtime yet. And the sun is not out 100% yet. The weather is okay. I think it's a high 75 like I said today. No big heat. So we're down at Palace Playland. So West Grand Avenue. So it's gonna be West Grand, and you're gonna have East Grand on the other side. All hotels, motels, all the way down through. Like I was telling you guys, you can hear the train is coming. You got some public restrooms over here. Mom and Pop hotels. The Lafayette chain, they own probably uh, 15 of the big hotels here. I'll just walk over here. I'll get over by where the train is going to come by, give you guys an idea. And once that train comes by, we'll call it a video. All right, let me get over here and watch this guy come in here. I don't know. I, I have a feeling the train comes in a little fast. I don't know where we're from when you're going through a town, the train's supposed to slow down, but I guess here 
in Maine, it doesn't have to slow down. All right, the these just came down, came down there. Train is coming. Oh, it slowed down. It's not coming that fast. So we'll get this guy. Oh, it looks like it might be a passenger train. So all the people are here. Look, some of them are crossing. Look at this. Oh my God, look, she's just standing right there in the middle. She's got to get that picture right in the middle. Trying to get her phone to work. Can't figure out how to use her phone. Still trying to figure out how to use the phone. Oh, there she goes again in the middle. Look at that. Now she's disappointed. All right, the train stopped right there. I don't know if it's a passenger train, it could be. That's why I stopped there. All right, that's as good as it's gonna get. Here's the two St. Bernards we saw at the beginning of the video. Beautiful dogs. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that. You guys have a chance, you guys go check out our other videos. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next one. Adios, amigos.